Welcome to another massive day. Today we're going to be talking all about Shopify and how to supercharge your Shopify store. If you haven't thought about Shopify as an option for starting an online business, now is the time. It's probably one of the most cost effective ways of getting an online business set up. Today I'm going to talk to you let first of all guys let me know if you can hear me in the chat let me know guys drop a comment let me know i'm gonna hang around wait for a few people to show up ah thank you lewis thank you as you can see i'm doing this on my own today Lewis bailed out at the last minute. Maybe you were expecting uh, Kevin David to show up. Well, Kevin David told me that he thinks that I'm awesome and I can handle this myself, and Lewis said the same. Isn't that right, Lewis? Okay, guys, a couple rules, all right? First of all, hang around to the end because we have got a massive, massive special for you guys, a massive surprise. G'day, Kevin. Nice to see you here. From Scotland, how are you? Good stuff, Carrie. Hey, Cynthia. Hey, what's up, soldier? Cynthia, she's one of my she's one of my people. Okay, so make sure you hang around at the end. All right, I'm going to show you guys what you guys can win here today, just for being here. All right, Kevin David's unfair advantage, his best seller at the moment really changing lives, changing people's perspective on yeah, how to grow wealth. If you want to get into the mind of one of the best entrepreneurs, the most successful entrepreneurs in the world, who is absolutely killing it, well, hashtag live and make sure that you're getting the chance to win. All right, I'm going to show you a few rules for how to win this unbelievable prize. Okay, check them out. All right, how to enter. First of all, give this live a like, okay? Don't leave me hanging. Second of all, hashtag live if you're here live. Hashtag replay if you're catching this replay. And make sure, guys, that you save your question for the end and ask your questions in the chat. You can drop, actually, you can drop your questions in now. We will track these questions. We're going to open up the forum at the end, all right? Make sure you hang around to the end so you don't miss out on our special, all right? So let's get started. How to go from e-com beginner to e-com ninja, all right, using Shop Inspect. Today I'm going to demonstrate for you some amazing software for finding a viral product and take you through a few things in Shop Inspect, all right. Then I'm going to open up and talk and let you guys answer, ask me some questions, okay. I've got plenty of experience building Shopify stores, 20 years marketing, marketing experience. I'm here to help. I'm here to add value. G'day, Juliana. G'day, Cliff. Hello, Kevin. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right. So I'm going to share my screen with you guys. Just wait for us. Wait for it. Wait for it. Just waiting. Can you see this? Let me know if you can see my screen. I've got a few lives coming in. Good to see, you guys. Can you see my screen? Let me know. Here we go. Here we go. Coming up now. All right, this is Shop Inspect, guys, okay? This is our amazing Shop Inspect. We made this specifically for Kevin and for you guys, Kevin's Ninjas, to make sure that you, know, you can get the most out of your Shopify store and you can do this kind of stuff really easily, all right? There was a need for it. There's a gap in the market. We filled that gap. And now I'm going to show you how to use it. So I'm just going to take you through here how to find a viral product, all right? So, and then I'm going to take you through the rest of these um, things very quickly, teach you guys how to use Shop Inspect, all right? First of all, 
All right, this is how easy it is to find a viral product on Shop Inspect. You can either do it this way by just clicking hot trending products and go through. All right, this will show you, this will just literally strip the internet and show you all of the Shopify products that are absolutely killing it at the moment. Okay, so if you want to start a Shopify store, find something that you're passionate about, do a scroll through, all right, run through, and you can find something that really appeals to you, right? Are you a BMX bandit? Okay, well, maybe you're going to choose some bicycle gloves, all right, gloves. Okay, so have a look at this. This is your gloves. You can see this at Shop Inspect is throwing this up for you, and we can have a look at their images, what they've got available. Let me just check my messages. John Michael. Hang it, hang on, mate. We'll keep that question to the end, okay? So back over here, you can see I've found these viral bicycle gloves that actually look pretty cool. The photography is really, really good. All right. I'm not sure about a wiping towel. Yeah, that kind of looks a bit funny, but hey, <laughs> whatever floats your boat, all right? So if I like this, I can see here it's got a four and a half star rating, right? I can open this up and check on AliExpress what it is. Okay, free shipping, nice little pop up there. Not bad, not bad AliExpress. Now I can see here the price of $10. This is a buy price, okay? You can see it was added six days ago. It's, it was added six days ago, okay, and it's it's basically gone up 41% this month. It's had 2,313 orders, was 1,645 orders last month, okay? I'm going to take you through this in a sec, okay? If I scroll down here, I can see that the factory price is $10.07. The shipping cost is included. This is the beauty of Shopify. You don't have to pay any money up front. When they buy from you, you you get the money and then you just give the supplier the little bit of money that it costs you and they will do the distribution of the product. So you can see here the total cost is $10. The recommended selling price is $22.99. So that's a 50% margin, not a bad margin, probably where you want to be for Shopify products. The profit's $12.92. And here are some suggested interests for ad targeting. Okay, so you go into Facebook, you use some of these interests, outdoor enthusiasts, outdoor adventure, road cycling. There's probably a few other ones you can use there. So use your imagination and do your research, D-Y-O-R, do your own research, okay? Um, here we've got our word cloud, some other things that people are typing in, fantastic for keywording and SEO of your product. And down here, we have our customer demographics. You can see that this is a you know pretty well stacked male product. Okay, lots of you know decent forty percent female, sixty one percent male. If I scroll down here, I can see that of that sixty one percent of males, sixteen percent are in the eighteen to twenty four category, and then we have this massive spike here, where thirty five percent of that whole sixty sixty one percent is male, 25 to 34. We have the next range here, which is a decent amount for the 35 to 44 range. And then it drops off a fair bit down here and here and here, okay? So really, if you're doing any targeting, you wanna look at males from the 25 to 44 range with interest in outdoor enthusi as, as outdoor enthusiasts, outdoor adventure and road cycling, okay? Pretty straightforward. So. If I want to now make a video of this product and put this product on Facebook and create a video ad, which everyone knows video ads are the most effective around, right? This is how easy it is with Shop Inspect, okay? Look, I'm just gonna click this button and see what happens. As you can see, I've clicked the button and this is actually creating the video description all right, selling feature heading one, heading, you know, subheading. Now, this shop inspector will literally create this for you, okay? But of obviously, do your own research 
and and put a bit of effort into your copywriting and into how you write in your descriptions because descriptions and words sell. Okay, images tell, videos tell, copy sells. Always remember that. Okay, so I'm gonna just I'm I'm just gonna let them have that for now. I'm not gonna go change that too much. I'm gonna create this video here. And just waiting, just waiting, just waiting. Success. Okay, so I have my video created here. I'm gonna download this video. Okay, and I'm just gonna open that for you to have, let you have a look and play this amazing music. How about that, guys? How about that? So that's how easy it is to create a video. As you can see, all the text has been thrown in there. So like I said, important to actually write that correctly. And once I've got that video, I can go, I can upload that um, into my Shopify store. So now I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna go back to that search that I did, right? Hot trending products. Go down to these crazy gloves. I'm gonna add that to my favorites going to go to my favorites if i want to upload this to my store i will download the csv open it up as you can see it's created the csv the whole product everything for me and i'll just go into my store and upload that to my store I'm not going to show you that today because i want to take you through some of our other features here on shopify okay let me just check in make sure that i'm not missing anything here Sounds like Jungle Book music, lol. Absolutely. Who doesn't love the Jungle Book, Kevin? Okay, so I'm going to check. I'm going to go back to Shop Inspect now and take you through a few of these other features. All right, premium video, that's a service I'm not going to talk too much about today, but that's for really, really high level video. Okay, as you can see, if I go into my favorites, I've got my favorites in here. Only I've got my glow in the dark that I did last time. You know, that's something that really appeals to me because I've got a young daughter who won't sleep and keeps everyone up at night, and usually just in a generally bad mood. Okay, so you can see these are my two favorite products that I've researched. These are my videos, obviously, that I have created. Lots of these ones testing out, and that's my latest one here. Shopify products, I'm going to go into here and find a Shopify product fast, okay? So maybe I want to find something that I love Maybe I love vaping, all right? Beware of vaping. That's just the first thing that came to my head. There are regulations around this in different countries. But if I type that in, I can see that I've got all these different vaping products, right? And one of the most, um, one of the biggest trending stores at the moment is actually a vaping store. That's probably why I thought about it. But that, as you can see, you can go in here. It shows you, you know, the, this is this is the um, the site, and this is actually the, the trending store. Okay, as you can see, it's a pretty cool store. Okay, they've got their you know twenty percent off still. Probably should have that updated by now. Uh, pretty pretty comprehensive store. There's a lot a lot of stuff on this store. Got your product reviews. Got shop now, pay later. Fantastic initiative. Saw favorite selections, etc., etc. Subscribe, etc. Okay, this store is absolutely killing it at the moment. All right, so that's your, that's how you do a, a, a Shopify search. Okay, now I can also do a Shopify shop search. Let me just check this, check my my comments because you know I am doing this alone. Guys, make sure to type in hashtag blooper if if you see any bloopers. We're here for a good time. Please engage, let us know your comments, stay to the end, hashtag live or hashtag replay if you're catching the replay. All right, let's get on with it. So if I want to find a viral shop fast, a really high performing shop, let me just type in um, something like beer because in Australia we like beer. I think Americans like beer too. In fact, most people like beer. So why don't we just see what beer brings up? 
Okay. Well, here we go. Let's have a look at this one. Love pop cards. No, I'm not going to look at that. That's W Kid Robot, Strange Ways. So there's not really a lot of beer websites out there, okay, as you can see. Beverages Direct. Let's have a look at this baby. That sounds pretty damn good. So I can click on here. Takes me to the store. I'm going to go back to the home. And look at all this stuff we've got. All right, this isn't this isn't real beer, but you can kind of see this niche, all right? So this is a fantastic, this is a pretty good site, okay? Beverages Direct, right? Info, FAQs, just talking to you about some of this stuff. Really important to have a good About Us section, right? Now, let me review this. Let's have a look at what they say here. Since 1998, Beverages Direct has been delivering unique and hard to find beverages right to your door. We constantly source beverages from all across the country trying to accommodate every drink lover. Enjoy a craft root beer or select from our numerous beverage samplers. We have seen many brands and flavors come and go over the years. Each beverage develops its own followers, blah, blah, blah. Okay. First thing I notice is there's a lot of we here. All right. Now, something like this, a, a brand like this, Beverages Direct, they obviously have a pretty decent marketing budget. For you guys that are setting up your own Shopify stores, right, you're probably going to be trying to discover a viral product. You're not going to go all out until you find that viral product that works. So you're really just looking at one, one to three product pages, testing out a particular niche, running your Facebook advertising for conversions, and seeing if you're getting any bites, okay? If you're getting sales, that's when you'll expand out to putting hundreds of products on your website, okay? Right now, you just wanna find a niche that you're passionate about, one that works, one that's selling, right? Now, if I go back to this About Us page, you wouldn't say this we, we, we stuff. You would be talking from the perspective of your customer. One of the greatest quotes I've ever heard, and I'm not sure who made it up because plenty of gurus wanna throw it out, is that if you can enunciate the pain or the vision or what your prospect is looking for and what's in their head better than they can, all right, then you're, that's a sure way to sell your products online, okay? So, for instance, I would say something like, you know, you know what sort of beverages you like, you know that the beverages speak about you and about your personality, and you love to taste new and different stuff and have a party in your mouth, whatever it might be, okay? Well, any beverage that you are looking for, you will find right here in our wonderful world of beverages, okay? You should be talking like you're talking to your customer, all right? You instead of we, all right? So focus on that, okay? Now, moving right along. So... I can just go down here and just look in the top Shopify stores. If I want to see what people are doing right, I can go through here and I can just drop in the top, the, uh, have a look and, and look at these shopping specs, just really stripping all of the best, most successful stores out and just delivering them right to your door. Now, why is this important, guys? Well, a lot of you guys, we're giving you the tools. We're telling you how to set up your store. We're telling you how to advertise, okay? But you've got to go out and learn on your own, all right? We're giving you the tools. We're giving you the strategies. But you don't just stop there. Entrepreneurs do not just stop there, okay? Entrepreneurs who are passionate about what they do, who are looking to grow and looking to learn, they will go and they will look at what the best in the business are doing and they will emulate that and make that their own. So let's check a few of these stores and see what have a look at what they're doing. Okay, I'm going to scroll down a bit because and go, and load a few more because th these are really big brands, right? And I just want to find something that's interesting. Well, obviously that caught my attention. Excuse me, that's that's you know. Sorry, I hope that wasn't um, too offensive. So let's check this one out. M M M V M Watches .com. Okay, so I'm going to go here and I'm going to have a look. It's loading up right now. While you're waiting, remember to hashtag live. Remember to get your questions in. Okay, and look at this beautiful store. Most of the stores, guys, that I see 
have a really clean white palette. All right, a really clean white palette. It's just it's just the most it's the it's the most um, unobtrusive color. Okay, too much color in a store. You know, depending on what store you're running. Okay, if you if you're in, doing a really vibrant, try, you know, attracting a really vibrant sort of um, sort of character set, then then you know use use vibrant colors, but use them sparingly. Now look at this. I've I've got this. This has just jumped up. Join the MVMT. Sign up to receive exclusive first access to products, launches, and limited releases. They've got three very special words in here, guys. Exclusive, first, and limited. Okay? So if you want to be in an exclusive crowd, who doesn't want to be in an, in an exclusive crowd? Don't you want to be in an exclusive crowd? Do you want to be first? Do you want to get first access, be ahead of everyone and ahead of the game? And are you going to take action because you know that you're going to get limited releases? Well, I think I'll put my email in there. Let's have a look and see, okay? I'm going to get my access and see what happens. Great. Continue shopping. All right. That's a nice, pretty easy, pretty easy pop-up, okay? I like to put my pop-ups on exit, all right? My belief is you shouldn't just be throwing a pop-up at someone who's just arrived at a store because they haven't taken in your store or your message yet, all right? But obviously, that's working for these guys, and these guys are a pretty big brand, all right? Now that I'm here, I can see it's it's very easy. Men and women shop now, trending now, and beautiful photography, okay? All very consistent. And down here, yeah, look, a gift guide. You're looking for, for some gifts? Let's look here. Okay, what is MVMT? This is really important, guys. Okay, this is the brand. The brand. What is MVMT all about? Look how they're doing this, guys. Okay. Can you see who we're looking at? Pretty cool, right? Very specific demographic here. Very specific demographic. Let me know if you can pick the demographic. Put it in the comments. All right. Okay, I'm going to move out of here. But why is this important? Why is this important? Because, because guys, this is important because if you don't have a brand story, if you don't have a message, if people don't feel part of a community, a movement, philosophically attached to your to your store you don't have a backstory you don't have a purpose behind your brand then you're not going to do very well all right it's no good throwing images and text and prices at people without any sort of message without any sort of copywriting so for anyone who is building a shopify store i highly recommend i really do recommend you get yourself a copywriter you can get a copywriter for 10 you know, for $10 an hour on Upwork, there are so many amazing copywriters out there and they love to write copy. They will turn your text into something beautiful and targeted to your target market. So definitely recommend getting a good copywriter. Personally, myself, I also recommend getting a good developer, okay, because developers you can get for $4 to $10 an hour. If you, find, if you look on um, Upwork or Fiverr, you're going to find – a whole host of them, be selective, try them out, okay, and make sure that they follow instructions clearly, that they show an initiative, all right, and that they and that they execute and test everything that they're doing, all right? That's that's really important. But the, the point is, you know, you can see what these stores are doing well. You can literally go through and check out what these stores are doing well. This is another one I checked out yesterday. Let, let me see if you guys can pick pick what what we you know what sort of demographic we're targeting here okay think about what your niche is who are you going to be targeting All right this is the yoga outlet really cool store really high performing store okay first thing I notice is there's really not a lot of uh, okay here we go here's the pop-up Peace, love, and 10% off your first pro, pro, you know, your first purchase. Join our community for updates on our trendiest and best 
performing styles plus 10% off your first purchase. Another, again, join our community for updates on the trendiest and best performing styles plus get 10% off your first per purchase, okay? So very important imagery, the text, everything that you do on your store has to have a reason behind it, okay? You can see that this is strictly targeted to trendy women. There's no men on here at all, okay, about this brand. Free people, really important, again, free people, the go-to for all things boho has expanded their popular line to include amazing activewear, you know, collection. Okay, so this is about the actual brand, all right? I'm not going to I'm not going to keep going through this too much. All right. I'm going to go back into shop inspect here. All right. Guys, let make sure you're putting hashtag in the comments and make sure hashtag live in the comments. Make sure you stay to the end because we're going to give you an unbelievable deal here. All right. So moving moving forward, okay? Finally, I just want to show you drop shipping university. All right. So we have created these videos for you to teach you exactly how to use Shop Inspect to maximize your shopping, your Shopify store, your e-commerce store's potential. All right, that's it, guys. That's the demo for today. All right. Now I'm just going to open up the forum for questions. If there's anything you want to throw at me, let's hear them now. I'm going to. I'm just going to check through and have a look at what we've got here from you guys. Okay. I'm just going to get rid of my screen now and come back on up here hello carby you're new here and it seems encouraging well i'm really really glad to hear that mate i'm really glad to hear that i hope that you're enjoying this live kevin calendar hip hop not sure what that means hey dylan yeah yeah back right back at you mate bobby thanks for saying great info it makes me feel a lot better hey kevin david's in the comments good to have you here legend um, all right, all right, let me check some of these. Whoa, far out. These questions are coming in pretty hard and strong. Okay, so let me find my core questions. Hey, where are, where are all your questions, guys? Where are all your questions? Does anyone have a question about their Shopify store? Let me know. Cynthia, I can see that you're live. Good to have you live. Hey. What else have we got here? What else have we got here? We've got 41 ninjas here. 41 ninjas and no questions. Muhammad's telling me yes. Cynthia's telling me live. What are you guys up to? What am I missing here? What am I missing? Oh, here we go. No, guys, we're very, very quiet at the moment. Very, very quiet. I'm only going to keep this open, all right, for another two minutes, okay, because I'm not going to sit here not answering anything. That's just going to make let me look stupid and you guys feel bad, all right? So while we're waiting, guys, okay, if you want – Shop inspect, okay? Make sure you check out this deal, all right? I'm going to put it here for you on the screen. You can get shop inspect here right now, okay? But that's not just it. That's not just it, okay? You can get it here right now. But if you put in this special little thing here, Wait for it. There's your coupon code, guys. There's your coupon code. Hey, Diane, thanks so much for saying that, man. I really appreciate it. Yeah, we'll, we'll do one next week. We'll make a Facebook ad next week, okay? Um, we're, we're doing this every week, guys, so just make sure you tune in. Tune in. All right, we're going to have guests coming on. How can you find Shop Inspect? Check this out, mate. Check this out, Bobby White. Look right down there, all right? It's going to be pinned in the comments, okay? I'm going to pin that actually for you right now on the page. Let me just copy that for you. There you go. 
There it is. Let me know if you can see that. Okay. Make sure that you use this coupon code, guys. 2020 Wealth is going to get you 50% off. Julie Gray asked, is shopping shop inspect for beginners? Well, absolutely it is. Where else would you start except for exploring and finding the products that are going viral and selling right now? Now, like I said, needs to be a niche. You need to have a niche you want to target. You want to be a small fish in a big pond, not a not a small a big big fish in a small pond, not a small fish in a big ocean. Okay, so think about your niche. Find your viral product on Shop Inspect. Test it out very quickly with a simple Shopify theme, all right, and make sure that you're running your video ad. Test it out with your metrics. If you're getting responses, if you're getting sales, it's likely you're in a good niche and you've chosen a good product. If you're not, you can scrap it and move on to the next one. Let me have a look at what else we got here. Why would someone wait 10 days for shipping when you can buy instantly in a shop or get in two days from Amazon? Good question. Well, why would someone wait 10 days? Let me see. Um, well, if you've got an amazing niche and you've got an amazing brand and you've got an amazing story, right, and you have an amazing customer experience and when they receive that product, they feel like they're part of a community, they're obviously going to wait, they're, they're obviously going to be fine waiting 10 days. Aren't they? That's the whole point I'm trying to make here. Okay, no one's going to wait for a product where you're just throwing a price and an image at them and they've got nothing to connect with. But if you have a powerful brand, a powerful brand story, a powerful message and a powerful community, right, that's when people are prepared to wait. Okay? And if you feel like you're a part of an exclusive community, people are always going to be willing to wait for that. All right? Amazon is a very different beast, okay? You're not, you're just, you're searching products. It's very, very easy, but their, their delivery times can be quite long as well, especially if, not, not all the time, but for Australia, I mean, when they're delivering here, it's always going to be about 10 days. So as long as people are connected with your brand, of course, they're going to wait, all right? And people are lazy these days and people are joint going online more and more. We need instant gratification. If we want to buy something, we don't want to have to drive and go out and deal with the chaos of shops. Why would we when we can go online? And why would I go anywhere else if I have a brand that is is specific to my niche and I feel connected and part of? It's just simple. I will go where I feel connected as a consumer and where I feel valued as a customer and where I have a good customer experience. Hope that answers your question. Let me uh, let me see what else we've got here. Well, we've got a lot of yeses. How can I find Shop Inspect? What else have we got? Any more questions? Yep, got that one, Lewis. So, Andy, thanks for contributing. Thanks for your message and for your question. Let me know, does that answer your question, Andy? Let me know in the comments. Cynthia, thanks so much. You guys are being really nice. I might as well, while I'm waiting, just run through some of these very, very kind comments here. Uh, you covered everything I had questions on. Finally got analytics down. Thank you so much for all the info. You and Kevin have been a blessing. That's really, really nice. It makes It's a really, really beautiful thing. It's what we get out of bed for, right? Helping others, helping others succeed, helping others join the freedom movement, okay? Freedom to have a laptop lifestyle, to be able to work from wherever you are in the world as long as you've got a laptop and a Wi-Fi connection. Do it on the beach if you want, as long as the Wi-Fi is there. What else have we got here? Let's show some other stuff right now, okay? Just want to get some of these beautiful questions up here. You and Kevin are awesome. Can you make a Facebook ad? Absolutely. Dylan, Dean, let me know where you're from. Dan, if you check our last live, I actually did take us through a Facebook ad. We're going to be having guests coming on that are way better than me um, to show you guys to do how to do a range of ridiculous things, all right? So stay tuned for the coming weeks. Same time, same day, every single week. Okay, what else have we got here? 
Carvey, this I'm new here. This seems encouraging. I'm really glad to hear that, mate. We're here for your support. We're here for your success. Okay. Our success, Kevin David's success, is built on the success of his students. If you guys aren't succeeding, how can we possibly have a business? Right? So, of course, I'm really glad to hear that. Julie Hastings, just giving you a shout out. Great to have you here. We've got 46 ninjas here, guys. This is amazing. This is amazing. Make sure you get hashtag live in the comments or hashtag replay if you're going to if you're going to catch the replay. All right? And of course, of course, like I said, make sure that you use your 50% discount to get Shop Inspect to try it out. I'm here to help you if you join our Ninja Masterclass. I'm here to provide you guys with one-on-one -on -one support and give you advice and feedback on your stores, critique your stores, connect you with copywriters. I'm here to do as much as possible to make sure that you guys succeed, okay? So please, please utilize me, all right? This is the reason I'm here, okay? So don't forget to sign up for Shop Inspect, okay? Where are we going next? Let's let's see what else we got here. Okay. Julia Lorrington. All good now. This is one of my mates, Julia. How are you, Julia? Hope everything's going well. Really good to see you here. Really, really good to see you here. Hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are in the world. Let us know where you, uh, you're shouting out from. Lyndon Jones, a bit of a thumbs up. Nice and simple, mate. Thank you. Really enjoying that. Thanks a lot, mate. Okay, who else? What else have we got? Not sure what that means, but uh, yeah, I'm going to reply with a yes to that, mate. Okay, what else have we got here? I can hear you nice, Kevin. Now, th this is Rory, but Kevin is in the comments, so reach out to the man. Reach out to the man and make sure you get his, you know, his best seller, Unfair Advantage. If you guys want to win Kevin's bestseller, Unfair Advantage, hashtag live, drop a comment. Not many, too many people in the running right now to win, okay, because we've only really got one question at the moment. So, you, you know, you're, you're in form, mate. You're up, you're up front here. Hashtag live, hashtag replay, like the post, love the post, laugh at the post. If you think that I've just been running off blooper after blooper, do whatever you need to do to make sure that you react. And let's see if we can get a couple more questions at the end here. All right, let me check. Have we got any questions? Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Muhammad Mabin, you started his work with AdWords. Great, mate. Do not just limit yourself. Do not limit yourself to Facebook, okay? First of all, guys, you know, we see that a lot of people are having issues with ads getting banned on Facebook, accounts being banned, all this stuff. And a lot of people just seem to, to act like they're, you know, like they're, they're hamstrung, like they're paralyzed when their Facebook account goes down. Guys, Facebook is one advertising platform, okay? We have Google, we have YouTube, we have Snapchat, we have blogging, we have email campaigning. One of the most important things that you can have in your Shopify store is an email automated onboarding series, okay? That is the perfect way to introduce someone to what you're all about, to who you are as a person, to who you are as a brand, to why you started your brand, to who the people are that should be following your brand, okay? And a perfect way to add value. Like Gary V says, right? Jab, jab, right hook. Okay, what does that mean? It means value, 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 right hook. So maybe your first email is a welcome to our family. My name's Rory, and I started this business because, la, you know, X, Y, Z, and because I wanted to make a difference in X, Y, Z. Okay, the second email might be, what is our brand all about? Who are the people that should be in our community? And then clearly enunciate the people, the target market, their feelings, their dreams, the pains they're trying to escape in your second email. Third email, add value. Maybe write an article on something cool, relevant to your industry. 
fourth email, reach out and say, I don't know, add some value some other way. And then on the fifth, on the fifth email, hit them with a VIP voucher or a 50% off or whatever it is, okay? Because once people are buying from you, they are the most effect, easiest people to sell to again. Let's see if I've got any more questions here. What is a good lo a good site for logos, Cynthia Val? Well, let's uh, let me just check what else, what else we got. Okay, Cynthia, a good site for logos. Well, go to Fiverr. You can go to Upwork, but very very importantly, okay, think about your logo. You know, do some research. I always, you know, I like to get creative direction before I go to um, to a logo designer, right? I, I am a logo designer, okay? I've designed hundreds of brands, hundreds of logos, probably close to the thousands, so many corporate identities, okay? Even as a designer, I don't just start with a blank canvas and start designing. I go to Behance or something like that, you know, Behance.com, or sorry, Behance.net, where there's basically so many creatives out there posting brand identities, mood boards, um, logo designs, and but they don't just present a logo design to you. They present a logo design in a brand environment. So you need to think about how you want, what's your brand environment, what's your colors, what's the mood, okay? That, that you know, this one, I'm going to go back to MVMT. I'm just going to quickly show you my screen again, all right, just to talk you through this. All right, stay tuned, stay tuned. Shared screen, let's go back. Go back. Look at look at the mood. There is a very specific mood here. There is a very specific color range. All right, muted, dark, brooding colors. Okay, the target market of young, hip, active, edgy people. All right, you can see you can see the mood. You can see the feel. Very simple logo. Okay, you can go on Behance. I'm going to type. I'm going to type that in here now. Actually. And just show you very quickly, very quickly, what you can find on Behance. This is some branding that I checked out the other day, all right? I needed to design a brand for, actually it was a hair salon, but she gave me a brief that it needed to be very clean, very modern, okay? And this is just one of the, the, the creatives that came up. A brand is not just a logo. Now, that logo is beautifully simple, but if I was to present that to you as just the logo, you kind of probably wouldn't get it right? But if I present this to you as the way they are presenting it here with the typography, with the mood boards, you know, with the little animations and the feel, the flow, look at the, look at this beautiful, beautiful um, typography here, okay? Now you can see how a brand comes together, okay? Now you can see how a brand comes together. So before you go for a logo, do some creative research, find a direction that you really like, and then provide that to the designer for your best possible outcome. I hope that helps. Let me know if that helps. Is it better to have, okay, we've got one here from Renton. Is it better to have a single product store or a website with a variety of products? Um, look, difficult question. Um, sometimes people like to have a variety of products and a range of products to see what works. But that's really just a test. You don't want to be running a general store, okay? That's that's pro that's probably not going to work for you, okay? I believe that you need to just try one product and one niche at a time. Do it quickly. Set it up quickly, okay? Run your Facebook ad. See if you're getting results and responses, okay? Like I said, it's got to be something you're passionate about. You need to have a niche, okay? Wow, we've got 54 guys. Wow, 54 here. Thanks, ninjas. 54 ninjas here. Like I'm saying, right, I recommend doing just one product, maybe one to two products on the store so you've got a couple upsells if need be, okay, but really just testing one product at a time. If you're going to do a general store, it means you're going to put a bunch, <coughs> excuse me, you're going to put a bunch of products on there. It's going to take you more time. And you might, and that's a time investment. That's a money investment, okay? Time is money, right? We're just testing at this stage. When you're just starting out, you're just finding something that works. Use Shop Inspect, 
to test viral products, find something that works for you, run your campaign quickly, okay? It doesn't take anywhere near as long to set up one store with one product as it does to set up a general store with five or 10 products, okay? So do what's quick. You're only in research mode. It's only when you start getting results that you double down, okay? So I hope that answers your question. Uh, you're, you're totally welcome, Cynthia, and you're such... Cynthia is another one of my mates that's um, going to be... You are going to have such a massive future, Cynthia. When I first spoke to you, it was just... You had the most engaging, vibrant, beautiful personality. Please reach out to Cynthia and friend her. <coughs> she, she's a beautiful lady. She, she's been through a lot, and she's, and she's still so selfless. Um, it really just you, – your story inspires me. I, I hope that you – and I can't wait to see you get that out to others with your, with your digital course and everything you're doing. And, look, you're not even <laughs> running a Shop Inspect store or a Shopify store, but you're here just – sucking in the info and being here so that's really cool um awesome to have you julie gray thanks for your comment wow <laughs> um, i'm not sure the context of that but that's that's really cool uh bay area bobby white bay area can this product really go behind the scenes of my competitors well i've, I've done the demo for you mate what do you mean behind the scenes um we're throwing up the info for you. This is um, a beautifully created product specifically for people who want to go on Shopify and do product research and supercharge their Shopify stores. So best thing I can say, Bobby, is why don't you try it? Give it a red hot crack. Entrepreneurs, they try stuff. They try stuff all the time. They learn from every experience that they have. You know, an entrepreneur, they can never get ripped off, okay? Because an entrepreneur learns from every single experience that they go through. If they have one takeaway, right, they've learned because knowledge is power and knowledge is the way to self-discovery, to self-improvement and to becoming your higher self. So my advice is try it out, mate. It's a 50% off. Have a crack. What else have we got here? Well, I'm going to take a few more questions, Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, Muhammad, yeah, we've got Muhammad. What's the best niche or a good niche from Shen Shantia? Shantia, best niche. Um, a, a broad question, Shantia. I, I suggest, you know, finding a trending product that appeals to you and that you're passionate about. Business is hard, okay? You're not always going to, you're going to fail over and over and over again. That's how you dis develop. Um, yourself, okay, and how you become a better person and a more resilient person. But when you're doing something that you're passionate about, you're selling something that you're passionate about, like it just comes out, right? Okay, it comes out in your personality. It comes out through your subconscious. It attracts the right energy. You believe in your product. So find something viral on Shop Inspect. Find something that appeals to you. If you love camping, sell camping products. If you love riding, sell cycling products. If you love going to the beach, sell beach products, okay? But make sure that you find a very specific niche and a very specific customer avatar personality that you're going to be targeting, okay? I hope that helps. What else have we got here? Any more questions? Let me check on my Facebook. Yep, guys, that's pretty much all for today. We don't have any more questions, okay? So once again, just a quick recap, all right? If you want to win Kevin David's Unfair Advantage, the book that is changing people's mindsets and introducing them to the movement, and you want to get in the head of one of the world's most successful entrepreneurs, okay, who's going out, doing the business, and showing his, his, his students how to do the same. First of all, give this live a like or a love or a laugh, okay? Please don't give me an angry face. That's just going to hurt my feelings, all right? Type in hashtag live if you're here live. <coughs> Excuse me. Ha type in hashtag replay if you catch the replay. 
ask a question. You can ask in the replay if you like. We're going to be monitoring these chats, okay? And you will be entered to win Kevin's unfair advantage. Again, let me tell you about this deal. Look down below, guys, okay? As you can see, <coughs> oh, God, excuse me, far out. So as you can see, check the pinned comments in your comment strings. Here's the link, okay? Get me Shop Inspect right now, all right? Type that in, all right? Just click the links. It's going to be pinned, right? And make sure that you use this code, all right? 2020 wealth. Do you want 2020 wealth in 2020? Well, you're about to get Shop Inspect, which is already a ridiculous, ridiculous price for the service offered. Fantastic software. Um, and now you're going to get 50% off. Why wouldn't you take that deal? It's not going to be around forever, guys. It's going to be around for probably one or two days, right? We're going to take it down. So don't don't blame me if you miss it, okay? Okay, I think I've I think I've taken you through and shown you what it can do. If you're going to start a Shopify store, this is an absolute no-brainer. Okay, and the 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 thing is, if you don't, one of your competitors is going to grab it, and then they're going to be successful. All right, so yeah, get into it, guys. Get into it. Um, all right, I'm going to wind this up. I'm going to wind this up. I want to say. I love you guys, all right? Thank you for being here. On behalf of Kevin, who loves his students and is, is so active in just tracking and finding out the problems of his students and trying to address them, shout out to you, Kevin. I love working with you. Um, here, you know, here's to the haters, um, and we're always trying to improve. We're always trying to do better. We're not perfect. No one is. We cannot improve without your feedback. Our students are the most important thing in the world to us. Thank you for showing up. Hashtag live, hashtag replay. Be in the draw. It's been a fantastic turnout. Next week, same time, same place. Come armed with questions, guys, and good luck in the draw to win Kevin's unfair advantage. All the best. See you, crew.